But uh, <laughs> let me uh, tell you a brief history of our love affair. <laughs> so I, uh, I was born in Lofa de Polito, which is now the, a very popular resort area in the Philippines. Of course, it passed most of the time. But uh, my father was from Batak, so there's a closer basin city. And uh, the house of Paz is just across my grandparents' uh, house, you know. Anyway, as a great owner, I spent some time with my grandparents in Batak. And we used to play together. We used to play together. So in fact, uh, I ended up having 27 injections because past dog beat me. <laughs> I remember that very well. Anyway, we will fast forward. Uh, high school, I was in Manila. This is where I went to school. And pass, of course, was in Bata. So, in my fourth year, I spent Christmas in Bata, and I, I saw her, and I think to myself, wow, <laughs> this girl looks good. <laughs> so, I started, uh, I wrote to her, but then, it's a good thing she responded to me, but she didn't want to be bothered. She's still young, and she wants to go to school. Like that. Anyway. Four years later, Fortune Collins, still, she was not being nice to me. <laughs> and uh, so the only thing that I could do is give uh, her a stolen kiss. Uh, <laughs> and uh, she, was, she was so mad at me, you know, I didn't want to see you anymore. So anyway, uh, after a few weeks, after a few days, I decided to go see her at school again, see if her attitude changed. <laughs> to my surprise, to my great surprise, she was smiling at me. Oh. Yeah, I <laughs> oh, this is it. This is my girlfriend now. <laughs> that's, that's our story, you know. We the, uh, I went to med school in the park, and after graduation, I didn't have any money, but uh, I was also to go to come to the U.S. And uh, of course, all I, uh, I planned our future, you know, and of course she was always a uh, part of that future that uh, I was trying to, to build, build. Anyway, uh, I went to see her. We had, a, we, we had a secret wedding, you know, because her parents didn't really like me. <laughs> because they think I was, uh, I was a boozer, you know. Because when I go to my back, my, my friends there, all we do is drink. And, uh, and then, of course, my family, they were not so nice to their wives, you know. And, uh, that's the reason their, their family didn't like me, even after. I was a doctor, I became a doctor already. Anyway, to make this story short, we had a civil wedding in Manila. We never had any, we got married today, same afternoon she went back to the top. And uh, during our silver anniversary, I wanted to have a nice, uh, a nice uh, reception also, I guess. At the time, I can already afford a little bit, you know? But she said, no, we need that. And, and came this 50th anniversary. And I was telling past, maybe we should go on a cruise. Let's take this 30-day cruise. But she wouldn't go for that. So we just decided to spend our 30th anniversary in the casino. <laughs> <laughs> and every summer, we come here to Michigan. I was hoping that uh, one of the kids would say, hey, Dad, you know, let's, uh, why don't we celebrate your golden anniversary? I never heard anything. <laughs> and, I, and my wife said, you know, I guess, I guess this is it. Just you and me. So I told her, you know, us, it's just you and me now. And we have our kids, you know, but they have their own families. 
their primary uh, priority now is their family. We are just a bystander now. <laughs> so when uh, Paul picked me up at his house, I just had my denim pant <laughs> and my golf shirt. And a good thing I uh, I did here with my uh, rubber shoes, you know, because it's supposed to be the birthday celebration of Emily. <laughs> and uh, when we came to the door, June Santos was there. So it's all I, you know, consolidated with my belief that it's really Emily's birthday. And when the door opened, I saw familiar faces, you know. It's like clubbing, what the hell is going on? <laughs> And I saw uh, the heavens, you know, all dressed up. I said, oh my God, I think, I think they finally, you know, answered <laughs> our prayer. <laughs> and I think it's very much my family, uh, Heidi, Tyler, Stan, Leanne, Jason, Roberta, and my grandchildren for uh, hosting this uh, event. I think in our 50 years of marriage, I would say that I could say that this is the most memorable of our of our life together, living together. And uh, thank you very much for coming, guys.